wait for it guys look at this oh my goodness this is absolutely what dude bro why man why i was i was showing wow all right guys welcome to the seattle boat show 2023 um, you know, I didn't really appreciate you closing it when it was, that was the best feature that brought my attention to this boat. Guys, I'm here with JR Marine in Seattle. Introduce yourself, gentlemen, so they can know who you guys are. Sounds good. Hey, I'm Jevin Upton uh, from Sydney, BC, where we manufacture these fine crafts at JR Marine. I'm Jared Mesger, Sydney, BC as well. All right. So, wow. Definitely first, Im first impression catamaran and like it looks rough and tough. Um, Tell me a little bit about the company. What you guys, what you guys, yeah, how, how it our evolved. Background, yeah. uh, our background was in commercial manufacturing of aluminum boats uh, for the last 16 years. And okay. we've had a lot of pressure from uh, the community to develop and launch a uh, pleasure craft. So we've gone with a commercial grade pleasure craft. Um, and this is what we're offering, a 26 foot uh, reverse chine catamaran. <clears throat> Cat, I love it. Catamarans big are thing the way. now in Florida. Stability, speed, it's big. Uh, robust. Rough and waters, any yes, you rough her. water. So, we, uh, we've dived right into that. Um, it's uh, nine feet wide on the beam and 26 feet long, so. Well, you guys uh, wanna show her so we can show the Offer Montaner audience? Let's go. Check uh, it out. Let's uh, go. All right, guys. Let's go ahead and check it out. You see here, we got our uh, proprietary lit up logo, the JR Marine, you go fishing in the morning, you turn your lights on and everyone knows who you are. Real proud of that. That's a new feature of our 2023 line here. So we got the walkthrough boarding doors, port and starboard. All manufactured latches, no rattling, no fuss, no muss, commercial grade. Come on in. Man, let me tell you, this whole area in the Pacific Northwest has unbelievable weld welding uh, people. Absolutely, uh, yeah. If there's anything I learned when I went to the Bremerton factories and stuff, and in and, and BC Canada as well. Yeah, we uh, have many craft, manufacturers. A bunch of manufacturers That's in right. that area. Yeah, we've got uh, four aluminum boat building companies just in our hometown there. Um, all doing different varieties, but uh, we're the only ones featuring the catamaran design because uh, we know the technology is here and uh, so we want to show the world. Okay, so we're showing the world right now. No, pr no pressure. Yeah. <laughs> we're showing the world. Okay. But listen, I'll tell you, you don't really have to say much because I'll tell you, this camera is glowing. It's smiling okay. and I'm, I'm smiling because I'll tell you right now, guys, this is absolutely stunning. I love the amount of space you have in here to do whatever you want, right? Yeah, we have four under deck storage uh, compartments, which are extremely spacious. Uh, we have in the back of the console, we have storage in behind there in the seat boxes, uh, ample amount of storage for all your fishing, camping, adventure gear, anything that you might need to get into. Wow. And okay. we upgraded uh, this model with a fantastic stereo for all the uh, music fans out there. This thing really bumps. It's got a 100, 160 uh, watt amp, uh, four six and a quarters, and a ten inch sub. So and, and a shockwave. Shock I mean, I, I've always said, yeah, shockwave mandatory for if you're over forty, you need a comfortable <laughs> ride. You add the shockwave to the catamaran design, and you're going to be comfortable all day out there. Uh, okay, so let's talk about the fishing, right? Because I can see a lot of fishermen really enjoying this yeah, particular so boat. Yeah. So what we got here is the proprietary T transom. Um, we actually add downriggers to the back here, so you, if you if you're, know what you're doing, you can fish two rods at the back and two rods at the side, so you can get four rods going at the same time. Um, I'm not that avid, I can get three rods going without tangling my lines, but... So, so, so basically here, you, you can have a ladder there as well, right? It's Coming a dive in ladder, correct. Yeah, we still offer some special features to make the boat unique for mm -hmm. the user. So the platform uh, and hull is perfect. Uh, and we want to offer the options to make you, the boat owner, happy uh, to customize it. What do we got here in these hatches? These are just open, ha open hatches. We got roto molded fish totes that go in there so you can oh, that's have nice uh, all your tuna, salmon and whatnot down in there um, with the fish totes that are removable. Wahoo macro. Don't forget about the Florida yeah, guys. Doesn't it, mean it, Hey, listen, the Florida guys, I'm telling you right now, we're going to start seeing boats from the Pacific Northwest in florida yeah because you know what a lot of people didn't know that these boats were around yeah because they only know what they see right yeah. and what they see is 
you know, the same regular, same boats, which are not bad boats, but I'll tell you, like, one of the reasons I enjoy doing what I do is because I show people, hey, listen, that's a badass boat, but look at this. Right. And all of a sudden, you're like, wow, that is different. You know? And different, yeah, different uh, zones parallel in, in weathers that you see, and, and we're seeing it rough up here. Can this be made there? completely enclosed without this if they wanted it? Correct, yeah, good point. We, we actually have developed three different cabin configurations. Um, we have this center console option with uh, canvas. We do a full width cabin okay. with a walkthrough door in the, in the forward. So you can get through fare all the way up to the bow for seating for the dogs and the kids and the wives and, and the friends. Um, and then no, we also I like this. Look at this. And there's storage everywhere. You can you can drop things anywhere, right? You have storage. Your cleats, I bet you you can pick up this boat through this cleat. You can. Yeah, we do at the factory. We lift uh, with our overhead gantry. We lift the boats up just by the cleats. From yeah. the cleats? You yeah. got Burnwin. Are these Burnwin mounts? They are Burnwin oh, mounts. Oh, no. Tom from Burnwin. Look at this, guys. Unreal. All right, uh, so this has definitely got to be one of the stars of the show right here, right? Because here, absolutely, show what you just started the video with. Okay, so I think this is this is huge, right? Especially for people down here in the Pacific Northwest, Correct. Alaska, yep. you want to bring supplies into your home. Absolutely. Avid hunter, uh, fisherman, you know, you're gaining access to a whole bunch of new area. Uh, very comfortable. Uh, we actually have a secondary slide out for the bow ramp that you can be added to so you can get twice the reach off the bow, mm -hmm. which is pretty unique as well and it self deploys. Can you make it wider so I can bring a quad? We do make it, it's called the bow down version okay. uh, and it's a whole nose cone deployment oh. where you can then drive uh, side by sides on quads. Um, we can do anything you need. Well, of course, and one of the things, and one of the advantages of aluminum is that. Correct. Right, yeah. you, you can just make it. Correct. Right, we, it's not like, you gotta make a mold and do it like, you know, so, so definitely. We're adding to value each customer individually to customize uh, now, the boat. Now, I'm 6'5", 225 and ripped. That's what I tell my audience, because I'm behind the camera. But I can walk up and down this without a problem? Hey, yep, we'll, we'll raise up for just a hair and then, yeah. Listen, if that if that thing lifts me while I'm on it, I will be impressed. Go for it. I'll stand on it. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Hold on, hold on. <laughs> Bring. All right, wait a second, guys. Oh my goodness, this <laughs> might not end well. All right, <laughs> don't worry about it. I got it. I got life insurance. We're good. <laughs> okay, start bringing it down a little bit, just a little. No bit. problem. <laughs> I got a Philly. Oh, that's not too bad. Wow, guys, look at this. Okay. You also, for um, another purpose for this is to retrieve divers. What's What it's doing is uh, avid divers okay. have a great change room up front. We can do custom bottle racks and we deploy the divers from the bow of the boat, which is a much more safe option than deploying from the aft in the props with the engines. It's a very versatile uh, adventure platform. Bring it up so I can look taller again. <laughs> wow, guys, look at that. That is, that is pretty impressive. Let me tell you something. All right, so market like what are you seeing market wise who's who, are you just seeing like diehard fishing guys or, or well who's? we have the luxury of living in the San Juan Islands uh, oh, with our beautiful. US friends as well and many people are commuting uh, living on islands uh, you know short long runs the weather does get terrible uh, so this is a perfect platform uh, to get them to and from on the day-to-day -day usage okay uh, and then as well since it's a trailable option allows you to uh, expand your adventure wherever you want to take it so you're using it as on the day-to-day -day and and uh, in any scene necessary. So I see you got more and more storage uh, lockers here as well. Correct, the exact same size <clears throat> uh, ports down there. You want to have a look inside there? Yeah, if you got something you want to show, yeah, yeah absolutely. Cool, yeah. Remember, somebody's gonna somebody that's really interested in this boat. Wow, look how deep this is. Downriggers, camping gear, whatever you need to get in there. Okay. How, how are we looking speed-wise with these Suzuki's that you have on there now? What, Excellent question. What, what, what horsepower are those Suzuki's? We're running twin uh, 200 Suzuki's on the back of this guy. Uh, we have a top speed of 45 knots, a very, very fantastic cruise at 28 knots with a really good fuel burn. Uh, we're running 90 gallons a side uh, for fuel tanks. It's almost 200 gallons of fuel capacity, which is extremely large for a boat of this size. And uh, yeah, it's just uh, one of the most stable weapons on the water. Okay, 
So we have somebody that's ready to buy. I already see it. They're gonna be like, hey, how do I get that lit up light on the side of my boat in the morning? They, what are we looking at price points for something like this? And and how long is it gonna take yeah, to make? Good right? question. We just uh, ramped up our manufacturing facility um, and we've been training uh, a very fantastic uh, lethal crew of guys. So we can now ramp up our production while maintaining that custom quality of commercial grade. Okay. Uh, so if you put a deposit down today in 12 weeks, uh, you can have a boat that you have itemized a checklist specific for 12 you. weeks? Correct, yeah. Three months? Three months, correct. And we can wow. do four boats at a time up at the new facility, <clears throat> monitoring each one for 100% quality to provide to our customer. Dude, I'm gonna sell three boats this <laughs> week. <laughs> this video is gonna sell three at a minimum. <laughs> all right, all right. So, okay, once they call, where do they gotta go? Uh, you're going to jrmarine.ca. That's our website. Uh, we're in Canada, we're building these things on the way to Alaska. Uh, so come check us out whenever you feel. Uh, we got an open door policy. So. A any other sizes that you're gonna have in the future? Yeah, we do actually. We offer a, a 36 foot uh, catamaran reverse chine, exact same 13 foot wide beam. Uh, it's a real beast. It's a full landing craft. You can carry an F-350 pickup truck on it or four quads or three nice. side by sides. Um, we have a, a liveaboard model fishing unit for Alaska uh, that we do on that platform as well. Is there anything we've missed on this guy? Uh, I think we've done a good job I and mean, we didn't get into the, uh, the joystick steering with Optimus. Uh, this has the I, capability. I, I do the Chicho. Have yeah. you ever seen the Chicho? It's a boat ramp. You got to watch my oh, channel. Oh, yeah, yeah, I have seen that. All right, so I don't want to give anybody any tips not to crash their boat. I, I'm here because you guys are trying to ruin my business over here. Yeah, right. All right, this is this is my serious size, actually, when I'm showing the boats. But listen, um, I want to thank you guys for showing me this. Seattle 2023 Boat Show, amazing show, amazing uh, boats. And this is one of the ones that caught my eye as soon as I got here. Well, we appreciate your time. Guys, J and R Marine here at the Seattle 2023 Boat Show. Want to go down again?